In this lecture, we will learn how to use the envelope tool in Audacity. The autoduck effect that I showed in the last lecture can be achieved using the envelope tool. The envelope tool is beside the selection tool. The eye icon is the selection tool and beside it is the envelope tool. Click to select the tool. With the selection of the envelope tool, notice how the look of the waveforms changed. You can see a lighter gray area and a bit darker gray area in the waveform. There is also a blue line at the top and bottom of the tracks. You can also see the mouse cursor is changed to two triangles. You can drag the blue lines to decrease the waveform height. If waveform heights are decreased, the volume will go down. If increased, the volume will go up. When I dragged, the whole waveform grew or shrank at the same time. If you try to select some part of the waveform, you cannot do that with the envelope tool. Let me go back to the selection tool. I can drag to select some parts in the waveform. Let's select the envelope tool. If I drag to select something, the whole waveform either goes up or down. So how do we control only certain parts of the waveform? To do that, click inside a point in the track. You can see four small white dots appear. These are control points. If you now drag from any other place, the waveform till the control point will be adjusted. Dragging up will increase volume, and dragging down will decrease volume. Let me get rid of this selection so we can see better what is happening here. I will now create two sets of control points. Clicking at any place inside the track will create a control point. I now have control points here and here. I can now drag the area inside those control points to adjust the volume. I can create more control points and adjust them to a very detailed level. So, what is the benefit of adjusting in this way? Well, you can increase or decrease volume arbitrarily easily using the envelope tool. It can be helpful mainly if you want to make some kind of special effects. The inner two dots of the four dots can be dragged outwards to increase the volume. I am dragging the inner dot upwards to increase volume. I highly recommend you practice with the envelope tool and you will find it easy to control. At first, it may feel a bit odd, but once you understand how it is working, it is fairly easy. Let's listen now to how it sounds overall. This is a Audacity course for beginners. I think beginners will be able to understand Audacity very easily after completing this course. You will record an audio and you will know how to get an audio file from that recording. There is another tool called Multi-Tool that enables both the Selection Tool and Envelope Tool at the same time. Take your cursor inside the waveform and notice which icon it is getting. If it gets an eye icon, then you can use it like the selection tool. If the cursor changes to triangle icons, then you can use the envelope tool. Practice what is shown in this lecture, and your audacity confidence will increase.